Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Today's video uh, comes to mind because um, in yesterday's video where I talk about my uh, my modified steering wheel, a comment was made that uh, many people would be very excited or just almost view it as uh, a near impossibility to even own a Tesla at all, let alone to consider modifying one. And it, it got me thinking, you know, I got to be perfectly honest with you. Uh, it's living in a first world country, it's very easy oftentimes to lose touch uh, of the fact that, uh, that we are very lucky here. And I got to tell you, I, uh, I went through a period of, of my life that I was, uh, I don't want to say ungrateful, but that I didn't appreciate my life nearly as much as I do now. And um, I would say in the last, oh, decade especially, uh, as um, we've had a, a couple of health issues in our family and, and different things come about, that, uh, that I've become much more grateful and, and thankful. And um, so, but specifically talking about the car, uh, <clears throat> yes, every single day I drive this car, I'm very grateful for it. And, uh, as I do modifications to the car and make changes to it, I don't want any of you to think that I am in some way dissatisfied with the car or um, that I, I take for granted the fact that I'm able to, uh, to drive a, a Tesla. It, it is a nice car and I, I enjoy it. And on top of that, I'm doubly blessed in that uh, this business uh, or this, uh, this car is for my business and that I get to drive it for my for business use, and then I'm triply blessed that I have my uh, this YouTube channel that brings in more revenue than the car costs me every month to own. Now I do spend uh, a a lot of that revenue on things, you know, the steering wheel, and, I don't know, just you know, the wrapping the dash in Alcantara, uh, even uh, the the. Uh, camera equipment, the, the camera, as well as all of the, the various accessories for it that I'm filming this with was paid for by the YouTube channel. My laptop I do editing with, my wheels have been paid for uh, by my YouTube channel. So so I am triply blessed. Uh, that being said, though, I, I put a lot of time into the videos and into my business to pay for the car, but I am... Um, not very many people from a worldwide percentage standpoint uh, can afford to, to buy, you know, decent new cars and that. And so, yes, I am very, very thankful. Uh, so it's, uh, it's an interesting thing. I think that, that too many people don't see their lives for the, the blessings that, that they have. And uh, everyone has difficulties. My life has certain difficulties to it. And, uh, you know, everyone's lives do. Now, as far as being lucky, uh, I don't know that I like that word as much. I would consider myself blessed. Uh, and because luck, I don't know that I really believe in luck so much. I Much of life is what you make of it, the decisions you make. Uh, and I mean, there's there's the whole metaphysical side of things. Of do you believe in in something beyond yourself? Uh, is there a God in the universe? And if so, does He have His hand on on what goes on around us? And that's a, a whole other subject. Uh, I happen to believe in God, and uh, my faith is important to me. But. Uh, whether or not we have luck is still, uh, luck implies a, a large degree of, of chance and um, a, a lot of life is what you make of it. So if you make poor choices, you're generally speaking going to have poor results. If you make wise choices, generally speaking, you're going to have good results. Now that's not 100% the case. You can live your life wonderfully and get hit by a bus that runs off the road or something. But you know what I mean by that. And so uh, I feel blessed to have this car uh, and other cars and, and whatnot. Um, 
and it is uh, much of that is because of hard work and determination but I was also dealt a decent hand of cards in my life I was born in America and not only born in America but in a, a county in America that is low crime and has decent opportunities so your your life is you're dealt a certain hand of cards but then it's also how you play those cards in your life that dictates much of what happens so health is a good example you take somebody like George Burns lived like the devil and made it almost to be a hundred years old well <laughs> he was dealt a good hand of cards his genetics were good to tolerate his hard living and smoking and all that through his whole life and yet he lived a long time uh, there are other people that that are very very healthy and die young uh, so there are some exceptions to this overall general general truth but the fact of the matter is if you live healthy you will generally live longer and live better if you live unhealthy you will generally live worse and die younger uh, if you make wise financial decisions generally speaking your finances will be good if you make poor financial decisions generally speaking your finances will be poor so uh, anyway I know this is uh, a different video from what I normally put out and I'm probably not going to get very many views on it but that's fine I just I wanted to answer that that comment because it is very true so um, and uh, as far as like I said this uh, a comment made about the during the steering wheel video is what prompted this this video today so I wanted to address you know, a lot of people really hate this steering wheel it's obvious in the comments section uh, and then there are those that really like it uh, I knew the steering wheel would be a polarizing a polarizing item uh, when I made it and installed it and uh, and that's fine I I don't have any issues with that that's 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 okay with me um, it's something that I that I really like. I also still own a, a stock uh, factory original steering wheel. So uh, the one that I mentioned in a previous video that is uh, from a later model, uh, Model 3 with the slightly textured leather and that. And I will always have a, a stock round steering wheel for the car. Most likely if the car goes in for service or anything like that, I'll probably change the wheel out just to do it. It only takes about 10 minutes to replace the steering wheel. So, uh, But I really like it. Uh, I think some people dislike the shape of it. Other people dislike the uh, the, the color of the, the leather on the sides. And I get it. Uh, in person, the color of the leather looks a lot better in person than it, it does on, on film. And um, I considered making it in, in black, but the wheel already looks kind of small and I so black would make it look even smaller and since the stock wheel is black I don't know it, it wouldn't look different enough in black uh, so I wanted to do it in gray and the perforations were done to give it a little bit of texture a little bit different look and um, so so that's the story behind that but anyway thanks guys for tuning in and uh, have yourselves a great day. I've been working on the composite steering wheel, so you will see more updates on that coming up shortly. Take it easy, guys. Bye-bye now.